Hi, my name is Ashish, and in this video, we will see install software on Azure Virtual Machines with the Azure CLI. Let me just launch the Azure Cloud Shell within the Azure Sandbox environment and take it from there. So I have my Sandbox environment created. I have my VM running with the name of uh, this sample VM, and I'm going to install the software. I'll just hit on continue. So I'm going to install Nginx web server. AZ VM list IP address, the name of this VM, and in the format, I'll just paste this command. I'll hit enter. Simple output. This is the IP address. Why I'm going to Connect to it, SSH Azure user. Azure user at the public IP address, which is 20.228.87.243.87.243. I'm sure, yes, I want to connect. If I do sudo so I'm the root user. I can install updates, which I'm gonna do now. Sudo apt get y update and sudo apt get y install nginx. So after I'm logged on to, I will run this command to install the nginx server. I'll do paste, I'll hit enter. Okay, but in installing, you can see the progress. It is packaging, blah, blah, blah. And after I do this, I'll exit and I will try to retrieve the default page by browsing to the public IP address of this VM. I'll just track my cell. Where should I keep this? Where should I keep it here? Okay, it is done. I'm going to do the curl command on the public IP address, which would be curl slash m on port 80 and the public IP address. I'll have to scroll up. I'll just copy it. I'll scroll down. What is happening with my mouse? Yes. Enter. I should get a call. The request working fine. It would fail because, right, so that is what I was doubting because I have not exposed the port 80 or I have not opened the port 80 through the NSG that would secure the network connectivity, right? So I'll use AZVM open port command. To open the port number 80 on this VM, let it fail. Timed out. I'll use this command to open the port. What the? I'm sorry, I don't know what is going on. I'll hit enter. Easy VM open port. Let me try again. Mm. Okay. Okay. Let me fix it and come back. It was not working because I was logged on. I was connected to the VM. So you have to click exit and come on the default so that you can do the operations on VM because I was connected through SSH onto the Ubuntu VM. So those were not uh, recognizing the easy VM command. Now the port is open. If I do curl command again, or I, if I just, you know, Hit it through. Yeah, right. So I just grab the public IP address. Control C. And I'll do this. This. 
and hit enter. See, welcome to Nginx. All right, this is how I installed it, and this is how you do it. So, if you want to do look at the summary and you want to do the cleanup, the sandbox automatically cleans up our resources when you are finished with this module. Right, so when you're working in your own subscription, it's a good idea that you remove everything. And if you're not, then after completing every module, you'll have to go for the quiz. And when you will check your answers, you will be given a message that you, you have completed your module. So you have to complete every module, you have to do the exercises, you'll have to do the quiz. And if you not do it, the module will not be marked as completed under your account. Okay, I hope this was useful for all of you guys. If you have any further queries, please mention them in the comment section. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.